most people who have aphasia with a stroke will get a fair amount of recovery, but sadly there are probably something like three or four hundred thousand people in the States who are p have a permanent expressive aphasia. And, and language is uh, so central to human existence. And um, I, sometimes people with aphasia are regarded as, well, as dumb, in both senses of dumb. Mm. But uh, they may have all their intelligence intact, but it, is, it can be tormentingly f frustrating to, to not have language. Speech therapy can be extremely helpful and should always be given for people who've had an aphasia. But there are, alas, some people who don't even respond to speech therapy and who appear to, to be landed with an incorrigible aphasia. And it's especially here that, um, that music can come in. Most people uh, with expressive aphasia can nonetheless sing. And not only can they get a tune, but they will often get the lyrics which go with it. I mean, for example, whenever I see people with aphasia, whether or not it's their birthday, I will suddenly sing happy birthday to them. And then, to their own amazement, they may, they'll be a little startled. You know, what's wrong with the neurologist singing happy birthday? And then they may join in, and they find they can join in. And this in itself can be a, uh, a huge reassurance as well as a surprise, because it shows them that language is still there, even if it can't be accessed directly, even if it's embedded in a song. In this so-called melodic intonation therapy, you will first get people to sing little phrases, um, you know, asking for their breakfast, saying please or thank you. Um, but then gradually you will try and remove the musical part and leave them with the language. Now, this is, um, now with something like Parkinson's and Alzheimer's, you're seeing, as it were, the immediate effects of music. He, th this is very different. Here you're using music for a new form of learning. It's, it's not easy. It will require 70 or 80 intensive hours of therapy, you know, plus, of course, use. But, it's, um, but to regain language, you know, one would give one's soul. So, so, so this is really rather amazing and beautiful.